Going to the movies is always a lot of fun, but there are a few things that we could all do without, like waiting in line. Standing for a half hour isn't so bad, but listening to your neighbor's conversation usually is. People waiting in movie lines will talk about anything, as long as it's boring. And the only time they pause is to shift positions and poke you in the back. Another thing that annoys me is the ticket stub. They always tell you to keep it. In all the years I've been going to the movies and keeping my stub, no one has ever asked to see it. They must have a rule. Never ask to see anyone's stub unless they throw it away. Okay, thank you. Keep this stub. Thank you. I don't know what the ticket stub is really for, but I have all of mine from the last seven years in case they ever have a surprise raffle. The next stop for me is always the refreshment center so I can get taken advantage of. Movie theater prices make the local 7-Eleven seem like a discount store. A lot of people like popcorn, but buying popcorn isn't easy. You have to decide whether you want the small, the medium, the large, or the tub. Fat people never buy the tub. They usually buy two mediums. Then you have to decide whether you want butter and salt. Butter won't hurt you because it's usually not real butter. But watch out for the salt. Movie theaters always have the world's fastest salt shakers. That's not good for you if you're on a low salt diet, but it's perfect if you're trying to sell the world's largest soft drink. I always try to find a seat not near someone who bought a very large drink because they're the people who are always getting up in the middle of the movie. Another thing that bothers me is that when you're sitting down, who gets the armrest? Is it first come, first serve, or are we supposed to battle with the person next to us? I mean, little nudges and just kind of subtly. I've won my share of armrest battles over the years, but I always spend half the movie feeling guilty. And what about the cartoons? They used to run a cartoon before every picture. Now they only show ads, like the little singing popcorn box, singing Let's All Go to the Lobby. And what about when the movie reaches over the end of the screen? Just doesn't quite fit. I know it's only a little bit, but at $5 a ticket, I want to see the star's feet. I don't have these problems when I go bowling. 